ça. Ah, le son de l'hôpital. Ah, le son de l'hôpital. Ah, le son de l'hôpital. Oui, oui. Deborah! Deborah! It is time to preach the gospel to Adeo Jejelaye. Preach to him. It is important. The man needs to hear the gospel. That I should preach? And he has just finished praising me. Am I not going to disturb him with my preaching now? I know I'm going to talk to Chief. But nothing. Don't worry. Give him a tract. Tract? Okay. I have a tract here. Let me go and talk to Chief. <coughs> That is Satan giving you instructions. During working time, you want to do the right thing at the wrong time. Hmm. Don't preach now. This is business time. Hmm. That is true. This is business time. I can't talk today. Deborah, preach to him. It is important. This man needs to hear the gospel. Giving the tract now. And afterwards, go and preach to him at home with his family. Today. 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 That is right. Today must be the day of his salvation. Tomorrow may be too late. Hmm. Tomorrow may be too late. I'm going to talk to you. Uh -oh. This is real madness. This man hates the gospel and the preachers. And if you dare preach to him, you will lose your job, your good job. You will lose everything, everything. You will lose your good job. You will lose your job. I can't preach. But God, you are not a God of confusion. Father, you are not giving me the spirit of fear, but of power. Of love and of a sound mind. I'm going to talk to Chief. You will lose your job. Ah. You will lose your good job. You will lose everything. You the spirit of fear. You lose your job. I bind you. Yeah. I cast you out of this place in Jesus' name. Yeah. I must talk to Chief. Where does that? Ebola, I thought you said you were going to see one of our customers. What have you come back to do? The Spirit of the Lord said I should give you this trust. Spirit of the Lord, you must be born again. Yes, Chief, you must be born again. You see, Chief, there is no shortcut to heaven. Jesus is the only way. The Bible said that we have all sinned and come short of the glory of God. Chief, the wages of sin is death. But the gift of God is eternal life through our Lord Jesus Christ. Wait, and wait, Deborah. Have your seat. See, Deborah, you know, I'm a very rich man. You see, it's been a very long time. And I've been looking for someone to come and preach to me like this. Hmm. You know I have money, a very rich one. Yes, Chief, and you have money. Chains of companies, both here and abroad. Hmm. The Bible said that what shall it profit a man? If he shall gain the whole world and lose his soul, nothing. But you see, despite all my money, riches, wealth, I still don't have peace inside of me. Hmm. I have this trouble. You know, I don't have any peace at all with all my money and with all I have. Hmm. Nothing. But you see, as part of my money, riches, wealth, I still don't have peace inside of me. Hmm. I have these troubles. You know, I don't have any peace at all with all my money and with all I have. Hmm. That, that is why you need Jesus, Chief. The Bible said that Jesus is the Prince of Peace. Hmm. When you have Jesus in your life, Chief, you will have peace. Because Jesus himself is peace. 
I would like to hear more about this. You see, the Bible says that for God so loved wait, the world. Wait, 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 wait. You see, would you like to come to my house and uh, preach to me as you are preaching to me like this? Uh, and uh, to your, uh, my entire household? Of course! And you come, Chief. See, there is an important meeting, an important board meeting that will be taking okay. place this evening. Yes, I know about the meeting, sir. So, the meeting, I and the entire family will be waiting for you to come and preach to us. Would you come? We come, Chief. You see, Chief, there is nothing that can hinder me from preaching the gospel. I will even be there before 6 o'clock. Thank you, sir. Don't forget. I will. We shall be waiting for you. I will be there. House. Your boss? Yes. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, this God is good. This God is a faithful God, is a wonderful God. Everything started in the office this afternoon. Hmm. The Spirit led me to, pre to preach to Chief, and I preached. But we couldn't finish everything in the office, so he asked me to come to his house. When I got there, I thought I was going to meet only the wife, the children, and Chief himself. But I was surprised to meet neighbors. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what old? I knew they were all there. And I preached to all of them. Old man, could you believe that they all gave their life to the Lord Jesus Christ? Including your boss? Ha. Everybody, old man. Everybody. Ah, this God is perfect in faithfulness. You know, he even said that he will now establish house fellowship in his company. Yes, old man. That surprised me most. In fact, I... old man, how did you know? Because that was exactly what happened there. How do you know, old man? I, I was just around the place. Mm. I was just around the place. Ah. Hmm. The counsel of God and the purpose of God for that man will now come to pass. Ah. Oh, you mean God has plan for that man? Ah. God has plan for whoever gives his life to the Lord Jesus Christ. Hmm. The moment a person gives his life to Jesus Christ, the Lord begins to take special interest in such person. Hmm. And the divine purpose of God begins to come to pass in his life. Hmm. And you too be expecting your miracles. <laughs> miracles? Oh yes. Yeah. There are abundant miracles up there hmm. for faithful and profitable servants of God. He hmm. says the branch that bear fruit, it will purge you that it may bear more fruit. Oh, be expecting sweet. your miracles. Hmm. Oh good man, before you go, please. I want you to tell me this time around where you live. I want to be coming to your place. I mean, we can't just be meeting on the road every now and then. I want to come to your place, old man. Please try to tell me this time around. I want you to know. I'm just everywhere. Good morning, Chief. Ah, Mr. Allah should be coming. Yeah. Have a seat. Thank you, sir. Uh, sir, before you travel out of this country, I have some things I want to discuss with you concerning this company. Go ahead. Thank you, sir. Sir, so I discovered from reports reaching us at the head office here that the company is really losing a lot of money. Uh, you can imagine within the last five months, we have lost a lot of money to the tune of 13.7 million naira. What? Yes, 13.7 million naira in Kanu branch alone. And I, you... I think we are operating that branch at a loss. And you as the director of uh, administration, Mr. Lashidu, what are you doing about it? Yes. Yes, Chief, I have a suggestion. So I suggest that we retrench all the workers in Kanu branch and inform Mr. Thompson to come back to the head office here in Lagos and continue his job as the director of sales department. Then in the head office here, we can trim down the number of staff, especially in the sales department, 
staff like Deborah and a few others can be laid off because there are too many in 